Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be doing a video over the new Final Editions. Um, they moved the Final Editions from, what was it, Wednesday to Tuesday? Um, I'm not entirely sure when they were coming out. I think it was Wednesday. They've now moved it to Tuesday, and they've gotten rid of the Chemistry and I think the Divisional Collections that gave you a guaranteed Elite in the packs. Uh, but those collections were expensive to do, but if you're into collections, they were fun to do. So it's kind of sad to see them remove collections, but all in all, I guess I kind of understand it. So the first card here is Dante Hightower, uh, a Patriot. I'm happy about that. Uh, actually, their Patriot schedule gets released here in just a few hours, and so uh, he led the team in tackles with 98. I wonder if that's 98 solo tackles or just 98 overall. Um, he's got uh, plus 9 to man defense and plus 10 to pass rush chemistries. Not awful. I'd love to see the plus 13 or plus even 11 or 12, but plus 9 and 10 are the staple normal amounts for uh, uh, the cards. So he's got an 88 speed. He's a very balanced in his general stats. 88 speed, 87 strength, 85 agility, 86 acceleration, 84 awareness, terrible catching at 61, 86 jumping, 91 stamina, and 85 injury, so really balanced there. He's got 94 tackle, uh, 90 hit power, which can force fumbles, not going to force them as much as somebody with like a 98 or 99, obviously, but he still can force some fumbles. He's got a good power move. Uh, he can block shed, so you can blitz him. Uh, Pursuit is pretty good. 89 player rec, so he can play a little bit of um, uh, coverage. Uh, next is Jerry Hughes. Left outside linebacker for the Bills, 91 overall. Uh, he was second on the team in sacks and first in forced fumbles. He gives plus 10 to run stuff and plus 9 to zone defense chemistries. It's nice to see uh, more Bills, more of the crappy teams uh, that had bad seasons get some more cards uh, to show for it. Uh, the Bills didn't have a terrible season, but they don't have that many cards that have been released. Uh, so people trying to build an all-Bills team, they don't have the greatest cards to choose from, but it's nice to see they get another card there if you're into that. Uh, he's got 88 speed, 87 agility, 94 acceleration, so he's great off the line. Uh, 93 jumping, so he can swap balls. Or not 90, 83 jumping, so he can swap balls. Uh, not going to be as great as if he had 90 or higher, but uh, still pretty good. He's got 82 tackles, 79 hit power, 95 finesse, so he's finesse over power, 83 block shed, 87 pursuit, and even a little 78 play rec, so he could play a little zone with the 62, but I wouldn't rely on that too often, maybe once a game or something like that. Uh, William Moore is the next card, 92 overall strong safety for the Atlanta Falcons. Uh, he led the team in interceptions and forced fumbles on that weirdly terrible Atlanta Falcons team. Uh, he gives a pretty bad boost to chemistry with plus 8 to uh, pass rush and plus 9 to zone defense. Not the greatest boost. Plus 8 is really low at this point. Uh, I would have loved to see it be plus 10 or plus 11, but it is what it is. Uh, so he's got 90 speed. Uh, not bad. Uh, 88 agility, 90 acceleration, 80 awareness, 73 catching, which is not awful. Could be worse. Uh, 89 jumping, 92 stamina, and 87 injury uh, for his defensive stats he's got 76 tackle 90 hit power which is nice he can for some fumbles uh, block shedding is at 71 so you could blitz him and he could have a chance to get off some blocks 85 pursuit 82 play rec 87 zone so 65 man you can't he's not a safety you're gonna be able to play uh, any sort of man uh, defense against or with uh, Rod Streeter a 92 overall wide receiver for the Raiders it's good to see the Raiders getting some support here. Uh, he led the team in receiving yards. Uh, he gives plus 11, so here we go, plus 11s here to a long pass and short pass chemistry. So that's nice to see, really nice to see, actually. Um, and I'm happy to see uh, the Raiders getting some support. Uh, I wanted to make it all Raiders team, but then I just... Uh, I looked around and it's just kind of abysmal uh, when I was playing like two months ago before I got banned. Uh, but he's got 95 speed, 92 agility, 93 acceleration, 84 awareness, 93 catching, 93 jumping, 86 stamina, and 94 injury. So a decently balanced uh, general stats uh, for his offensive stats. He's got 89 elusiveness, a 459 trucking, uh, 83 spin, 86 juke, 79 carry, 88 route running, 91 catch in traffic, 92 spec catch. 90 release so not awful um, catching stats uh, nothing really stands out but all in all pretty good and then the final edition reward for the collection is Cordero Patterson a 96 overall wide receiver for the Vikings um, I was waiting for this card to come out I knew they I knew they had to make a final edition of Cordero Patterson 
Uh, Cordell Patterson is a beast. Uh, he gives plus 11 to short pass and speed run chemistry. Or no, plus 11 to short pass and plus 8 to speed run chemistries. Of course, it's the signature edition, final edition card. And so that's pretty cool. Like all, all weeks, it's a signature edition. So he's got 97 speed. He's a burner with 97 acceleration, 96 agility. What's his release? 88. I wish, I wish it could have been a little bit higher, but it's fine. 90 catching, 96 jumping. 90 stamina and 94 injury. Uh, he's got 74 trucking, so he could truck one guy every once in a while. 97 elusiveness, 94 ball carrier vision, uh, 94 spin, 97 juke, 84 carry, 90 route running, 88 catch in traffic, 94 spec catch, and uh, some decent throwing sets, actually. And then he's got 98 uh, kick return. Uh, so, guys, let me know what you guys think of these new Final Edition cards. I actually kind of like these ones. Uh, it gives you a good uh, choice. It's got some different teams with the Bills and the Raiders. Uh, it's got some wide receivers, safety, D linemen, uh, linebacker. So, it's pretty cool. Uh, like always, 5,000 5, coins, a Lombardi pack, the Cordero Patterson. Uh, so, I hope you all enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys all in my next video. Peace out, guys.